Mopping out and clearing up. This morning, local businesses in Hearn Hill weren't opening their doors to customers, but to water. I got a call from about, uh, about 7 o'clock from my mum to say that Hearn Hill had been flooded. So I rushed down here and the water was about up to my middle of my thigh. Um, but the water was draining away quite quickly. These pictures give you an idea just how high the water's got to. A burst water main was to blame. At around 5.30 this morning, water began cascading down this busy road, finding its way into shops and causing extensive damage. In terms of cost for equipment, there, there's going to be at least £200,000 worth of equipment that, that's been lost to get the equipment up and installed. It's, it's going to take a bit of time, but we have certainly try as, as hard as we can do. Around 36 properties in the area were affected, including chemists, restaurants and butchers. Those further away from the water main suffered less damage and are already clearing up. Yeah, we've got about two, two and a half inches of water. It took me about an hour, hour and a half to tide it all out and get it ready to open again. One of those things then? One of those things you've still got to carry on, haven't you? No, it's not one of those things. It's a nightmare, it's a disaster. Oh, Thames Water have got a lot to answer for. Thames Water have apologised and say their priority is to get things back to normal as quickly as possible. But for some, that may not be so easy.